Do you know how and why a mother can bear the pains of labour, child birth? Knows it will pass and you'll get an amazing gift in the end. Right. Yeah. So there, there's already right intention, right understanding, right attention. But as a physiological experience, now, of, of course, sadly, a lot of women today have lost the level of connectivity to be able to move with and through the process and too much fear and resistance and limitation has been cultivated around childbirth. However, if we are really connected to the innate feminine power that is designed for that, what happens is we naturally move into the right breathing rhythm. And we understand that actually those contractions are forces of energy working through us and with us. And life is actually a force of energy drawing this child into the world. So it's energy that she is actually engaged with. So if you engage with any pain, and believe me, you know, labor, I've been there, labor is actually as a, you know, a phenomenon, a very intense state that we would call one of the highest levels of pain that can be experienced. But if you have that right understanding and right attention, you can be with it. In fact, you can not only be with it, you can be the bliss of it. When I was in labor, the, the entire team of nurses, the midwife, the doctor, they just couldn't believe it because I had extended labor and I was in a state of utter bliss. And that was going on, not just for a few hours, it was going on for two days because I've got what's called a, uh, a flower pot pelvic structure. My pelvic structure is incredibly small. I've got a little yogini's pelvic structure. So it's not physically the ideal size and frame to carry a baby to pull forth. So there was a lot of things physically working against me. Yet because of that right understanding, right attention, I was in a state of bliss. So what I'm pointing to here, when I use myself as an example, it's not to, you know, beat my own drum. It's as an example for you, an inspiration for you. Every single time I make a reference to this, that's why I'm doing it. I want you to see that within the human experience, there is absolutely this potential and you are human. You have within you the same capacity to meet anything and everything with a different level of awareness.